at it again today. Um, still chasing those speckled trout, trying to put them in the uh, in the fryer. You know, 14 inches to keep. But you know, I have been uh, you know getting a few, but they've been 12, 13 inches. You know, I've gotten uh, I believe three uh, keep respect so far this year. Um, I have gotten a, quite a few bites. Um, you know, where they've been biting my gulp shrimp in half. Um, so what I did do is I actually went and bought some of the smaller two-inch varieties of gulp bait. Um, as opposed to the three inch, almost four inch varieties. Um, so you can see, looking at the size difference here, um, I'm gonna see if going to this smaller bait here actually gets me more fish, more hook sets, and fewer of these gulp baits bitten in half because um, I don't know if you price these things, but when you get these in a pack of five or six, whatever they come in, they're like four, you know, four something up to like almost seven dollars a pack. So, you know, that's, you know, when you get one bit in half, you know, that's a dollar and some change. So. We're going to try the smaller baits here today, and uh, we're going to stick with these. This is the New Penny uh, in the smaller variety. I also have Molting uh, in this smaller variety, and this is the Molting, which um, I've you know caught quite a few fish on um, here throwing these gulp baits uh, here in the fall, winter time frame. let you see that is the new penny um, also with the orange jig head so I got my orange jig heads going again today you can see that bait is much shorter and um, that's a blue notorious for biting those baits in half um, he did chunk it pretty good so it's cut but um, I still have the bait so so far mission accomplished Be going. I, I was like, what? <laughs> I thought that one had a little size on it. Yeah, he wasn't pulling back, he was just dead weight. Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, this was my catch of the day so far. Had me going. I thought it was a monster. <laughs> Interesting. All right, the new penny is uh, hit a stalemate, so we're going to get it switched up here. We're going to go with the molting and uh, give it a few casts and uh, see if we can get our luck to turn around. So we got uh, one. Nice blue on the new penny. We're gonna switch it up, go to the molting, come back at you. Here we go, coming back with the molting. Again, this is the two inch, five centimeter variety. Trying to avoid getting so many of those bite offs. So here we go. All right, looks good. Orange jig head, molting, gulp shrimp, two inch, five centimeter, here we go. All right, we're gonna give the root beer a shot. Um, malting didn't produce, not today, not yet. So keep watching. All right, so here we go. Root beer gold, swimming mullet. All right, we're still trying to make it happen. Root beer gold, orange jig head. Here we go.
I confess, I did have to change my game up a little bit. I ended up going with a um, the swimming shad, the pearl white. Still gulp, but we got a flounder here. We're gonna measure. I think he's gonna be close. Maybe flounder dinner tonight. All right, keep watching. All right, so we got the orange jig head and the pearl white. So he hit it good. All right, he's breaking my heart, but he's got to go back. 14 and three quarter inches. So we're gonna be kind to the fish, get him back in there. But uh, the pearl white did come through for me. So we're gonna keep throwing it. All right, thanks for watching. All right, popping back in here real quick. Looks like I got into a school of flounder. But I can definitely tell you that he's not gonna make it so we're not even gonna measure him. He's probably about 10 inches. But uh, again, pearl white. All right, popping back in here again, pearl white. Flounders like pearl white today. So that's, that's what we're doing. Not big enough, of course, but uh, very cute.